Everybody knows Rubik's Cube. It has 43 quintillion possibilities to be scrambled. And there's a lot of people, the so-called speed cubers, who try by hand to solve that. The fastest ones within less than five se seconds. Now, Infineon is a technology company and therefore we would like to solve that by a robot. And here you see Sub-1 Reloaded, a robot which actually improved the current world, world record on November 9. Here you see with 0.637 seconds, unbelievable fast. How does this robot work? We have here six stepper motors who are able to change the different layers of the cube. We have sensors like two cameras in the bottom and in the top of the robot. At the moment the shutters of the cameras are closed. Once the system is started the shutters are opening and looking at the Rubik's Cube and then calculating the time optimized solution which is then executed by a, this motor control based on an Infineon Oryx microcontroller which runs on 200 megahertz with its three cores. This product is not only used in this robot which only shows the capabilities of uh, such microcontrollers but also in many automotive applications so in many electronic control units um, up to sensor fusion control units for autonomous driving. What we can demonstrate here is the full control loop from sensors, sense, compute, the microcontrollers and act, the power semiconductors driving the motors. So also a nice combination between the digital world where actually on this laptop the solution is calculated and the analog world where the solution is applied to the Rubik's Cube at the end solving it very much below one second.